Hey guys, Joe with Orlando Home Finders, and today I am in Winter Garden showcasing a beautiful one-story house. Hey guys, Joe with Orlando Home Finders, and today I'm in Winter Garden in the Disney Horizon West area. So this is a beautiful community and I'm showcasing a wonderful one-story home that has a loft. So you have the option to have a second floor loft with this house. Standard for this house, just over 2,600 square feet. It has three bedrooms, two and a half baths, and two car garage. But as you see it today, it has that loft and that loft makes it a four bedroom, four bath, a three and a half bath, and a two car garage. Hey guys, if you haven't already, Please like and subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell for instant notifications. If you want to see this house, give me a call Joe at 407 484 8458 or email me at orlandohomebinders at gmail.com. Hey guys, enjoy the tour. This elevation has the large covered front porch. Two car garage, I know there's grass in front. I've mentioned it probably in my last couple videos. This has the covered front porch with the pavers. Eight foot glass door with the side lights. Really nice pattern in this door. Beautiful foyer. As you can see, you have the tray ceiling with the recessed lights. Of course, decorated above and beyond with this shiplap on the left. The front of the house, formal living, office, flex space den. It could be used as many things. You can see it has that designed wall with the millwork. Front here be a coat closet. That's a traditional thing for the northerners. I'm from the north, so I know. Coat closet, as you see, the main area has hardwood floors. Beautiful blonde hardwood floors. I love it. 10 foot ceilings here. You see you have the crown molding. All right, should I go left or right? I'm gonna go right. So this would be your upgraded drop zone, utility cabinets, laundry room. This is fully upgraded. As you can see, you have the cabinets, the wet sink, hard surface, it's like a Corian. Solid surface countertops with the white cabinets. Two car garage. And a garage, nothing special, but it does have the epoxy flooring. That will be an upgrade. All right, so we'll go through this side. This is your Jack and Jill. Good size room, standard closet here. Let's go through the Jack and Jill. You can see you have your upgraded vanity, double vanity, quartz countertop. You have the white cabinets and the tile floors. Lights does not work. Anyway, this is pretty cool. You don't see this uh, pattern very often, but very cool with the subway tile. Jack side. Standard closet. Coming out of the room. While I'm coming out over here, this is the flower room. I like it. This is your half bath. You have the hardwood floors flowing into there. Before I go, linen closet. 
That is the bonus area on the right, going to your second floor loft. Leave that for last because check this out. Boom. So this, you know, you'll see this type of kitchen in million dollar homes. And at this price point, this is a million dollar living space right here. Upgraded, you know, desk station here. You know, office with your cabinets. Kitchen nook, formal dining, however you want to use it. And then your family room. I'm going to come back to those rooms, but because this is so deserving of a lot of attention. Large stools here, and you have six of them spanning this. Six, all right? And then you have overhangs on the outer side here. So seven and eight, eight chairs for that island, eight stools. That is amazing. Okay? That's how big that island is. You have a butler pantry over here. Stainless steel appliances. High-end kitchen cabinets here with the gourmet structure. I'm gonna pan over here first. So a couple things to notice. You have the 42-inch cabinets with the crown molding, light rail, but this is something that you see in the higher end homes as well. Cabinet tree matching on the range hood. So that's a high end upgrade right there. Giving this kitchen that high end look, finishing touch, beautiful backsplash here. Five burner glass cooktop, chrome handles and poles. Nicely done. All right, before I miss the pantry, another additional cabinets here. This is a great pantry here. All right, and you have a little nook over here, so if you want to put more shelving over there. Additional storage under the stairs. So if that loft was not there, And over high-end quartz here that's at least a level four quartz then you have your stainless steel farmer sink it's like 2500 bucks for that chrome faucet elegant pendant lights Oof. all right this I love this home I'm a big fan of one stories and this is a beautiful one story so family room Everything just flows, you know? If you want to be in the kitchen and you're entertaining and you're the chef and you're, you're not, you don't want to be left out, this is the entertaining that you want to do. Family room, 10 foot ceilings and then you have that, that looks like a foot for that tray ceiling. Wood paneling on the ceiling and these exposed architectural beams very light stain if any to match the blonde floors before we go into the kitchen we forgot about these triple sliders double triple sliders so you let your outdoor space become part of your indoor space two ways here all right, there we go. Indoor. And this is a really expensive covered lanai. How large this furniture is, you have a table, two benches, pergola out here, fire pit. So this is all upgrades. The models, you know, they do some nice things to them to showcase, to make you spend more money. <laughs> And there you have it. So this is your backyard premium lot over facing the pond here. This is an elevated lot. So if you had a pool, you have to build, you have to do a retaining wall here. 
but they just did an extended patio. They don't pocket, but you have two, just basically a wall of windows for this amazing space. I can't say, I can't say it enough how much I love this floor plan. Uh, and I do, I love one, large one stories, and this is, and for the square footage, I wouldn't think that it's this, uh, it's very big. All right, master bedroom, tray ceiling. That is some high-end millwork going on in that tray ceiling. You've got uh, some fancy wallpaper on the ceiling, and then you have the square, just a lot. <laughs> it just makes this room so elegant. 10 foot ceilings, another foot for that tray, and then three large windows in the back, two windows behind the bed. Structural upgrade to choose, but it's well worth it to let a lot of natural light into your room. Good space here. I'm in the seating area. Let's go into this luxury master bath. Double vanity, sinking sink, high end cabinets with the quartz countertop. There's no lights here on this side, but let's talk about this humongous shower. Two transom windows, frameless shower, step down. Large format subway tile. We go all the way to the ceiling in this hangbone pattern, and it has the light gray grout. Looks really fancy, super fancy. All right. So on that side, you have the bench. So if you shave your legs, shower head with your rain head shower and the shower niche. So those shower niches, I think like 300 to 400 bucks, I would at least get one, well worth it. Frameless shower on both sides, 12 by 24 tile floors, and it goes all the way to your master closet. This is a great size master. Size of a small bedroom. Flows throughout. All right. Beautiful bedroom. I love this house. I said it so many times, but I really do. This is one of my favorite floor plans right now. I have a lot of floor plans, but this is definitely up there. All right. So this is that additional loft. This has the hardwood stairs and hardwood risers and the floors continue on. Window to the left and then boom, there you have it. So this would be a knee wall. This has the upgraded rails and spindles. See how big the space is. It's really nicely decorated as well. Another view from here, two windows in the back. So you, you get the additional bedroom and bath. Love this bath, very nice. So if you're designing your bath, you bought a home and you're upgrading, you look at these videos, it gives you an idea for your color scheme. This is like a beige theme that has the vertical 12 by 24 is in a staggered pattern. 20 by 20, 12 four is the beige cabinets with the beige quartz. I love it. Oh, let me go back here. Crown molding. Center light. And this is your additional bedroom. Wow, 
as we're going to the walk-in closet. Yeah, that's awesome. Wire shelving, sorry. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the tour. If you want to see this house, this is a beautiful one story, 2,600 square feet. With the loft, it's even more than that. Three bedrooms, two and a half baths, two car garage. And with the other loft, adds an additional one bedroom, one more bath, and that extra space. If you want to see this house again, give me a call, Joe, at 407-484-8458, or email me at orlandohomefinders at gmail.com. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell for instant notifications. Hey guys, have an amazing day, and I'll see you around the neighborhood.